Hey, what's going on guys? Xwraithus here and welcome back to another Reset Day loot video. Now, last week, you know, full loot was atrocious, right? Um, last week was just terrible. We kind of got like one big upgrade on our Shaman, but that was kind of it. But this week, man, we're looking for something good. Now, I've been working on that Destruction Warlock 9.0.5 PvP guide for you guys. Now, I'm aware... Um, the new patch 9.1 will be out very, very soon. So this is actually, um, I'm pretty sure the last week of um, 9.0.5 in terms of opening the Great Vault. So this will be our last reset day loot video for 9.0.5, as I'm aware. And then obviously we will start 9.1 when that comes out. So man, it's going to be absolutely awesome when that patch hits i just really can't wait but in terms of you know getting keys done this week and everything like that well technically last week for this week um we did a key on my warlock my warrior my paladin and my monk obviously though my warlock's my main so we're going to um open up the great vault on him last because he's done the highest key um but in terms of lowest keys i mean my monk and my paladin and my warrior are tied for the lowest key, but we're going to start on my monk first. Um, but yeah, as I was mentioning, you know, that Destruction Warlock PvP guide, been working on that. Hopefully I can get that out um, by the end of the week or something like that. I just have a few corrections left to do, aka, you know, um, stuff I may have said wrong. I've got to correct that and, you know, just text on screen just to, you know, get everything as accurate as possible. So that's what I'll be adding on screen. And then obviously some images and stuff like that. And then I'm going to be compiling like a short montage, but that shouldn't take me um, too long. So once that's done, I'll be able to get the guide out for you guys. I am aware though, as mentioned, 9.1 is literally right around the corner. So um, hopefully I can get this out very, very soon. But to be fair, most of the stuff in 9.1 it's probably going to be the same as 9.0.5, but obviously I can't um, say that really because I haven't tried 9.1 out yet. So you never know, but maybe um, the builds will be quite similar. But we're going to jump onto my monk first, guys. Hopefully everybody's having a really nice day. Let's do it. Alright guys, I'm on my monk right now. Loot spec is set to Windwalker. We are currently sat at 208 item level with our PvP gear, but 213 overall. And man... We did a plus 10 this week, so fingers crossed I can get something good. Um, let's just accept this quest here. Win four battle battleground matches. Hopefully I'll have time to do that on one of my characters, but I probably won't to be fair because I'm working on this guide for you guys. But it's all good because we did a plus 10. We did a plus 10, so in terms of gear, man, let's see. What do we need? So we're going to get a 220, right? So... A weapon would be ideal. I know it's only four item levels higher, but that'd be cool. I guess a new ring. New, oh, new legs, new legs. If we can get some legs, that'd be decent, because that's my lowest piece it looks like, other than my PvP trinket. So we're just going to open it, kicking it off on my monk. Let's see what we can get. I would have liked to do more keys, but like I said, didn't have enough time. Crit haste, cape. Okay. Um... Now, in terms of ah, oh, hmm, in terms of stats, this isn't that great to be fair because I don't need haste, so I don't even know if I want it. But I think I'll take it just because it's high item level. So at least we can get some sort of upgrade. You know, we can get one armor, one agility, four stam, which is decent. But I don't know. I might use it, uh, but I also might not. So we we definitely have to experiment with this. Let me see. What does that put my stats at? So we're at nine percent. Well, 8.65% haste currently. That's going to put my haste up to 10. Oh. Yeah, and then my mastery drops too. So we probably won't, don't want to be using this. Um, we keep it in our bags anyway. We also got Mist of Tyrion Scythe, which is actually a decent dungeon. So we're definitely going to take that. Um, in terms of the fixes though this week, guys, we got Fortified, so non-boss um, enemies are basically stronger. We got Sanduin, so basically when you kill an ad, it leaves a pool on the floor that um, heals the allies and deals damage to us, who are the players. And then we got Quaking. Um, over time, um, basically, all players emit a Shockwave, um, inflicting damage and interrupting nearby allies. So you just want to make sure you're not um, casting while that's going off. 
Huh, and then obviously we have Prideful, so it's not too bad this week. Um, I'm going to jump onto my Paladin now, and then my Warrior, and then my Warlock. So let's do it. Alright guys, I'm on my Paladin right now. Loot spec is set to Retribution. Currently, we are 208 item level with our PvP gear, but 212 overall. We did a plus 10 as well, so in terms of gear, my Paladin is actually quite, like, decently geared. Like, he's quite good geared, which is nice. Um, I guess a new helmet, man. Imagine if we can get a new helmet. That's going to boost my item level by a lot. And also, if we got a new waist, that would be ideal. But, unfortunately, we can't. Um, I think people are here at the moment. So, if you hear any background noise, I do apologize. We're just going to kick it off. Hopefully, we can get a helmet. But, we need to upgrade our legendary. But, 9.1's out very so Oh, yes. Looks like we... Haste Mastery. Now, the stats are not that great. Haste is good. If it was Verse, that would have been so much better. Um, but, man, we got exactly what we wanted. That is awesome. There we go. Nice. 208. That puts us at 209 with our PvP gear. With my PvE set, that puts us at 212. Man, I've been wanting, uh, wanting a helmet for so long, and now we actually have one. That is awesome, and obviously, um, I'm not going to upgrade my Legendary this week, because obviously it might change in 9.1. You know, some Legendaries um, are probably getting buffed, and others are probably getting nerfed, so we'll wait and see um, when 9.1 comes out. I can check, like, the um, patch notes and everything like that, like, with everything that's going on, like the class changes and that, but I haven't, um, I've seen, like, the Warlock stuff. I haven't really dived into anything else, so I'm completely honest. I may have seen a couple of stuff, but I can't remember. So, yeah, but we're going to jump onto my warrior now. So, let's do it. All right, guys, I'm on my warrior right now. Loot spec is set to fury. And um, we are currently 210 item level, but uh, we are PP gear. 214 overall, though. We also did a plus 10. Um, in terms of gear, I would like some legs, man. Um, I've been wanting legs for ages. If we get legs... After getting a helmet, that would be so good. If not, we can get boots, shoulders, or something like that, man. I guess the best upgrades would be legs or shoulders, but legs mainly. So, if we can get that, things are going to be looking up, man. Come on, if we get legs, man, this is going to be so good. Let's open it up, find out what we get. Let's do it. Come on. Give us some legs, man. We just got a helmet. It would be so good. Ah, oh, shoulders. Do oh, wait. No, I need his shoulders. Let's go. That's actually huge. That's 20 item levels higher. And it's crit verse now. I always get crit gear on my warrior. And my warlock, to be fair, which sucks. But on my warrior, like, most of my PvE gear is crit. Um, so this is actually going to help out a ton. I mean, haste would be better. But I'm really not complaining. That puts us at 211 with my PvP gear, though. Definitely decent. And the shoulders look kind of cool. 214 with our pve there we go so with my pve set i have 27 percent crit it is actually ridiculous 34 percent mastery and then if i pop my uh yeah let's let's wait until my trinket comes up because if i pop my um my trinket there my um crit goes up by a lot as i'm aware so it's going to be actually really really cool um but i would have liked haste verse we also got the necrotic wake which is a good dungeon so fingers crossed we can do that i'm going to keep these haste verse shoulders in my bag and um, just because um actually to be fair a new pvp season is going to be coming out and everything like that so i probably don't want to hold on to them but we keep them anyway so about 27 percent crit pop this we are 39 percent crit you see, that is absolutely ridiculous. So, that's actually quite good. Now, if I was, like, um, Venthyr and I did, like, full crit condemn build or something, that may have been decent, but still good nonetheless. We're going to go on to my main now, which is the last character. Hopefully, you've enjoyed it so far. Oh, let's do it, man. All right, guys, I'm on my Warlock right now, and we are kind of, you know, towards the end of this video. So, the video is nearly ending, which is, it's definitely, you know sad because it's been a quick video in a sense and i do apologize for that but we've just been you know open up the great vault back to back and it's been quite quick which is not terrible i guess because at least you get to see what loot i could get without me rambling on all the time but guys we are approaching the great vault and man i'm excited because loot this week has been 
absolutely awesome. So if we can kind of, you know, continue that streak of good luck, then things are going to be looking up, man. But for good luck, what we're going to do, we're going to fleshcraft here. There we go. So we have the power of the Necrolord on our side. Our loot spec, though, currently set to Affliction. We are 214 item level with our PvP gear, but 219 overall. We did a plus 13 this week, and we... Um, did we time it? I can't remember if we timed it. Um, what dungeon did I do? Do, do, do. I think, yeah, we did the other side, I'm pretty sure, and we timed it. So, it's absolutely brilliant. Um, I thought we did. I This week, I need... What do I need? Let's see. Uh... I guess so we can get a 223 a new cloak new shoulder no a new cloak you know what a helmet would be ideal a helmet would be like the best but at the same time it's a it's a new um patch next week so to be fair I'm probably gonna get better gear next week anyway or just in general if I do the content um you know from the new patch I'm gonna get better gear anyway probably so you know what I'll take anything Let's do it, man. Let's just open it up. Helmet would be good, though. Not going to lie. Come on. Let's see. Oh, we got an offhand. When I said I'll take anything, I didn't mean it literally. Damn, man. Okay. Haste verse, though. Hold up. Hold up. 223 haste verse. <gasps> Let's go, dude. And we got haste verse. Oh, we got haste verse weapon. Hold up, guys. Hold up. What key did we get? Theatre of Pain. Oh, okay. Okay, that's that's actually decent. So we have a... We have a 223 main hand dagger, which we got quite a while ago, I'm pretty sure. And then we've got an offhand 223 haste verse 2. And the thing is, it's heavy on haste. I am 100% using that. Yep. So my stats are as follows. 6.11% um, crit. 25.67% haste, 46.43% mastery, and 15.23% verse. Equip these. I'm now at 6.11 crit, 28.30% um, haste. We also got 40.50% um, mastery, and then 15.20% verse. That is actually big, guys. We literally gain a load of haste, and we also... Do we gain any verse? I think we actually lose verse. 15.20. Oh. Yeah, we lose 2% verse, which isn't that bad. But we also gain a lot of... Oh, well, 0 0.2, sorry. Uh, um, damn. Yeah, that's insane. And we also gain quite a lot of mastery. That is so good. So I'm going to obviously equip these. 215 item level now. Definitely, definitely great. And then going to equip these two. Dude, that is awesome. I actually can't wait to... Man, I'm so happy today. We actually got some big upgrades. And it's the last reset date loot of 9.0.5. Like the last video. So, absolutely great. I am happy with our loot. I'm also going to enchant these. Which is going to be awesome. Wait, can I enchant them right now on video for you guys? Let's see. I can indeed. We're going to put Celestial Guidance on that thing. Where is it? There we go. Ready? Boom. Nice. Exactly what I wanted, man. That's awesome. We have so much haste now, so definitely ideal. Now I'll work on my transmog and everything. But guys, today's been an absolutely awesome reset day loot video to close out 9.0.5. Like, it's been absolutely great. In terms of that Destruction Warlock montage, though, I'll be working on that, that, that you know, constantly until it's out. So, fingers crossed I can get it out very, very soon. I've been working on that literally non-stop. I kid you not. It's been like, what, over a month now since, like, I've actually recorded the footage for that montage. So I do apologize. Obviously, you know, like, the PvP clips you're going to see are a little bit outdated in terms of gear. Because it's been, like, a couple Reset Day Loot videos um, since then. But at the same time, my Warlock hasn't really got that many upgrades. So it's not really that <laughs> outdated. Um, so it's all good nonetheless. But, guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, then obviously make sure to leave a like. Comment down below. Also subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to check out my social media links in the description down below. And also let me know what loot you got today from the Great Vault. Hopefully 9.1 goes great for you guys. I'm excited for it. Hopefully you guys are too. So let's do it, man. Hopefully we can, you know, 
get that patch out very soon, which, you know, it is coming out very soon. And just in general, hopefully we can get some good, good content and good, good loot. But guys, thank you for watching today's video. I'll catch you in the next one. So, peace! I'm so excited we finally got some good loot. Oh.